All right, guys, thanks for watching this Diagnostic World video. These kits are available at Diagnostic World. It's www.diagnostic-world.com. So right now, we are sitting in the cockpit of a Porsche Boxster. It's a Boxster 986. And we're going to demonstrate the connection of these kits with the, um, the airbag light on the Porsche Boxster. Um, it's a common failure and a common fault on the Porsche Boxster, but not all diagnostic tools will actually uh, communicate with the airbag system, so not all tools are actually going to be suitable. Now, I've kept this one in the box. This is the iCarsoft POR2 um, because this has pretty much the same functionality as the i960 kit, which is here. So these two are both made by iCarsoft, so I'm not going to pull this one out of the box. I just want to show you that the functionality is going to be the same. Uh, this one is called the Foxwell NT510. So what I'm going to do first, I'm going to plug in the iCarsoft. Now the diagnostic port is actually on the passenger side because it's a right hand drive car. And then what we're going to do is we're going to try and establish a communication with the airbag system. Okay, so if it, if it will allow us to establish a connection, it means it can read and reset airbag codes. If it gives us a communication fault, then unfortunately it means it doesn't work. Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to click on to Diagnose. Click on to Porsche. Then we'll go Boxster 986. Manual Select. And then we're going to select the airbag section. So if we go to read diagnostic trouble codes, it's giving us a fault in communication with the vehicle. Now that unfortunately means that this kit will not work on the airbag system on this Porsche Boxster. Um, to be honest with you, I already knew that was going to be the case. I just wanted to really confirm it for the video, for the sake of the video. And the exact same situation will happen with the iCarsoft POR2 as well. Um, now it's important to note that this only occurs on the Boxster 986 and the um, 911 996. Uh, so if, say for example if you wanted to diagnose an airbag fault on the 997 or 991 uh, or Cayman, Cayenne, Panamera, this kit will work. It's just on the 986 and 996 it will not communicate with the airbag system. So what we're going to do now is we're going to unplug this tool because we're finished with this one. And we're going to plug in the Foxwell NT510 kit. Okay, so this kit is now plugged in. And we'll select Porsche from the menu. Click manual selection. I'm going to scroll down to Boxster 986. Control units. And we're going to go to the airbag. Communicating with the vehicle. So we'll click on to read codes. And there we go. This time it has given us a fault. It's given us the airbag warning supply and it's fault 03. Um, so off the top of my head I'm not exactly sure what that fault means. I suspect it's a voltage problem. Uh, because the car has been sitting for quite a while without any sort of use um, So that's what we suspect that is but the main thing is we now know that the Foxwell NT510 kit is suitable for the uh, Boxster 986 and the same applies for the Porsche 911 996 as well um, So all of these kits are available at Diagnostic World It's www.diagnostic-world.com or you can click the link directly below this video or just search for Diagnostic World in your Google search engine. Thanks for watching and I hope this helps.